Welcome to Fasting and Prayer. My motivation? My youngest son David tested positive for a brain and lung disease and he was thousands of kilometres away. Breakfast. I missed that breakfast meal. By 11, after five glasses of water, I felt weak. Then I remembered the old juicer in the cupboard. Hurrah! It still worked! What was in the fridge? Celery, capsicum, some greens, equal two glasses of vegetable juice, multicolored. And it tasted good! Observations at two. Clearness of mind. Freedom of thought. Cobwebs cleared out. A sense of energy. Hunger thoughts gone. This highlights there is an intimate relation between the mind and the body. Intemperate eating is often the cause of sickness and what nature most needs is to be relieved of the undue burden that has been placed upon her. In many cases of sickness the very best remedy is for the patient to fast for a meal or two that the overworked organs of digestion may have the opportunity to rest. Fast a short time and give the stomach a chance for rest. These efforts will help nature in her struggles to free the system of impurities. Now for the prayer results. First week were prayers for my son, which later proved clear. Praise God! The second week a bottle exploded in my daughter-in-law's face. She was rushed to hospital and prayers, saving her sight. Does prayer and fasting work? It sure does. When we put ourselves out for the Lord, He puts Himself out for us. God bless you, friends.